Oh boy, I've got a low tire on my truck. Guess it's been, I don't know, it's been sitting a while, but I've had a slow leak in this thing for some time. Guess maybe it's time to get that checked out. I got a couple other errands to run this morning, so uh, let's get going. Yeah, had a good bit of rain, we still got some more on the way. And what's going on here? A little bit of traffic. Uh, oh good, it's the, the city cleanup crew. Good. A little late cleaning up all that crap. I got a bunch of leaves too. <laughs> Alright, anyway. First stop. Something by the old auto zone. Because talked to my brother-in-law last night in Mexico and probably if you follow my videos down there I got our first vehicle we drove in 2006 a 95 Oldsmobile Silhouette I've nicknamed the Blue Bomber because it's basically about to fall apart well I've had problems with the window motors they seem to not last very long at all down there not sure why but he needs another one so that's where I'm heading Right. Yep, so we'll go to the auto zone first. Then a quick stop to the bank. And then I'll get this tire checked and probably plugged if it's got a it's got a leak, which I'm sure it does somewhere. Yep, there's the bank, but I always work my way back. So, yeah, I think down through here, this is where this little neighborhood Walmart is supposed to be going. They're going to take that car wash out, this fireworks store, and maybe even this grill. Yep, I think all that's going. So, I'm supposed to start on that, I guess, if not this year, by next year. So, huh, that'll be interesting. A lot of people seem to be curious about it. A lot of people seem to be against it. <laughs> a lot of folks don't really care for Walmart. I'm kind of one of them. I don't go to our Walmart at all. I don't really want to, care to, or anything. So here's the auto zone. If I get this big rig out of my way, I won't beat the traffic. Okay, let's get this window motor. All right, well, there it is. Look, you could tell, brand new, once again. Now, these things are a lifetime warranty, so if I can get that other one down in Mexico, um, I'll just bring it back and be able to get it swapped out. So, huh. anyway, on to the next stop, the bank. Yeah, looks like some parts deliveries. Now, what in the hell is this? A four-door with racing stripes. Isn't that cute? <laughs> All right, anyway, let's get these errands over with here and go back home because it's still cold. And there's some more rain coming in, so. Ah, a little bit of traffic, my bad. And we're rolling. Slippy. Yep. Another few days and we're heading south of the border. A little bling bling shop. Yeah, it's so like I was saying, I think this whole corner here is probably gonna a neighborhood Walmart or some crap like that. I don't know That's what they said. So, yep, that ought to be interesting when it all gets developed. Anyway, let me get to the bank and out. All right, getting out of the bank. Get a little clustered in there. <sighs> and, yep, yeah, I think that's the last deposit I'm going to make. 
this year. So now, actually I might make a quick stop at CVS and then on to the tire shop. Yeah, the bank I was in there for about 10 minutes in line. It's like no one's fast and again the drive through they shut down earlier this year for whatever reason. So, uh, only reason I went there is because it's on the side of town where I've got to take care of most of my errands, so, oh well. <laughs> yep, so we're about here at the old CVS. Maybe we'll see the old, nice to pull out in front of me, uh, wet roads. Uh, generic drug dude, I don't see him. Well then. Boy, what is this? Idiot. Ah, try to get there. All right. I'll get in and get out here. Okay, alert. A coop. Is that really necessary? Ah, weirdos. All right, in and out of there, and no traffic good. Let's roll. Wow. Yep, yeah, wet roads. Now let's get this tire fixed. Uh, another dreary day. That's all right. Mexico, it's going to be nice and warm. Yeah, lovely day to get this done, but it's like the day before Thanksgiving, and I don't know if they're going to be open on Friday, so best to go ahead and get this done now so I don't get back in six weeks and discover I got a flat tire. So that wouldn't be fun to come home to. Bad enough with a dead battery, but I think I've got that fixed. So, all right, here we be. Let's get this tire checked out and plugged if it needs it. All right, pull in the old bay here. Not gonna be much shelter from this rain. Man, lovely. Let's see what's going on here. You got something? Uh, yeah, there it is. Yep, little tiny yeah, thing. <laughs> oh yeah, the diesel is coming down now. All right, that wasn't bad. 1450. They basically, I guess they don't do tire plugs anymore. They just do uh, patches. Basically, dismount the tire, put a patch inside, remount the tire, and go back to. It was back on the wheel. So. No balancing involved in that. So, uh, on this truck, I don't really know if I need it, but we'll see down the road if that'll be an issue. So, all the errands are done. The weather is still pretty nasty. So, I'm gonna head for home now, get warm after standing out in that garage. <laughs> oh, all right, I've got the green light. See the little bit of heavy machinery here doing some work. Where they were. Like to see this all get developed. This is an old textile plant that's coming down. Make way for a new business park or connecting the college to downtown. I know that. So yeah, that'll be fun. Pass by the old college. 
continue on home. All right, got the green again. Sweet. Got a lot of leaves on the road too after this storm. Lovely. All right, well, until the next fun adventure, I'm heading home, so adios.